Hey everybody, welcome back to Sports Central. Neil Duncan alongside Al Snow and uh, great footage there from Tiger Town. Of course, Ron Myers and that crew and the city of Lakeland do a great job of being tied bringing that event to Polk County. So, great event out there. Yeah, always uh, always doing some great things out to uh, Tiger Town and um, this segment. We've got a sponsor. Yeah, Hyatt this, Place of Lakeland. That's right, Hyatt Place <laughs> Lakeland Center. And, uh, you know, this last segment we talked about uh, Bach Tower Gardens, their 85th anniversary, and uh, a piece of inventory that's been around for a long time for us to promote mm -hmm. uh, and Polk County to uh, promote. Uh, but another piece of inventory we've had for a long time, uh, Westgate River Ranch uh, recently held some uh, events for us. FOA was out there as well as uh, Tough Mudder. Uh, and you and Chris Keprios were recently out there and uh, saw some new exciting things. Yeah, I mean, uh, FOA was just uh, just in the end of August and uh, had all, been what, what is FOA? I FOA, guess we I'm should sorry, mention yeah, that. It's yeah. the uh, Florida Outdoor Writers Association. Right. We had a group of uh, 108 uh, outdoor writers that came for a uh, four-day conference in August and uh, Chris and I had gone out for the first time this week uh, since that conference and the the changes that have happened at, at Westgate River Ranch are, are just amazing and uh, we've got Ray, Ray Duncan with us from Westgate River Ranch. Ray Boy, Westgate uh, has done some really good things out to River Ranch. It looks really great out there. That's right. We have just really still just going through it, but we're right at the tail end of a multi-million dollar renovation mm -hmm. of our entire property. All of our uh, accommodations have been totally remodeled, brand new furniture, brand new floors. Everything is, they pulled the old out, throwed it away, and throwed the new in. And we're really excited about uh a lot of great new things they've added to our 1700 acre property, our resort there. We've got a new adventure park now that features a zip line, a rock climbing wall, a bungee trampoline, and of course, what would a ranch be without a mechanical bull? We've got, <laughs> we call him Thunder, we've got a brand new mechanical bull ride, a brand new putt-putt golf course. That's just one of the many, many things that we've added as part of this renovation and upgrade to our property. We're really excited about things happening at Westgate River Ranch. Mm -hmm. I haven't, unfortunately, had the chance to get down there. I know we're not related. We have the same last name, but we're not related. <laughs> but but you need to get down and get on the mechanical bull. I, I do need to go down there on the bull. Maybe we'll take PGTV with us. But <laughs> what in the world, tell our, I, I know what it is, but tell our uh, viewers, what in the world is a glamping? Glamping <laughs> is a short term for glamorous camping. Uh, okay. Our glamping sites are, picture in your mind, if you will, a big heavy vinyl tent, mm -hmm. uh, not, not the tent that you would buy at Walmart, but a big nice open tent, 30 by 15. It's elevated up on a wood platform. Uh, inside of there, you're going to find beds with air mattresses and a portable air conditioning and some furniture, a porch. You've got your own barbecue grill. It's basically glamorous camping is for those folks that want to experience the element of camping, but they don't quite want to rough it. <laughs> they don't want to be out there busting wood and, and doing that kind of stuff. So it's just short of having the PlayStation or the Xbox is what you're saying. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> Take some look at some of the footage here of uh, some of the things there at Westgate River Ranch. It, it was really, I mean, we did get a chance to take a look at some of the, the glamping um, tents, and it's really neat. I mean, you've got this, this area with a, a big bonfire area in the center where they, you know, come in. There's, you want to bring uh, some... Um, you know, guitars and, and sing along by the campfire, but it's walking into them. I mean, there's a nice little kind of porch area inside the tent that's got some some wooden furniture. But you were you would think, other than the walls and the ceiling, that you were walking into a hotel room. I mean, right. it was you know wood floors and uh, you know the the wooden beds and the whole nine yards. So other than the the canvas walls and things like that, you'd, you'd think you were walking into a hotel. Yeah, tell us a little bit about some of, some of the, uh, the difference in, in what you guys do offer, because we talk about the glamping, but you also have regular, the regular lodge there, correct? We have everything from what we, we call a, uh, lo an efficient lodging, which would be like a one-bedroom suite. Mm -hmm. uh, that suite was the word I was looking for. But a one-bedroom suite with a small kitchen in it, all the way up to two-bedroom cabins. And we're currently constructing, I call them bunk houses, but it's, they're calling them park models, but I'm calling them bunk houses. It's basically a, a, a one room unit, and in the back you have a master bedroom. You come down the hall, you have bunk beds on either side for the kids, and then it has a living area, a living room with a fireplace and a television, and then you go out onto a porch that has a overlook, some of them overlook an oak hammock, some of them overlook a pond. 
but those are under construction. Mm -hmm. We're going to have 20 something sites of what we call park, bunkhouse park models. I guess is we're going to stick with that. Yeah, and, and we talk about, you know, called Sports Central. And uh, our first segment was talking to Bach Tower Gardens, who uh, 85 years, they're getting ready to celebrate. And then we talk about Westgate River Ranch, and you think, well, what's the tie to sports? But there certainly is a tie, because not only do you guys have these uh, accommodations, you can offer the facilities for these different teams coming in, like you guys are the host hotel for some of the, the groups coming in for the World Shoot in 2014. So there's definitely a connection in all this, and we promise so we're, we're getting to that. But uh, moving to the ropes course, it's team building. You can bring in corporate business into your facility as well. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, we offer team building for your your corporate group, your school group, whatever it might be. We have a brand new constructed uh, ropes course. We currently have the lower level elements of the course. Uh, what you may know as the truss wall where they climb the wall and then you fall backwards. That's one of the elements. Of course, all of ours have cowboy themed names to it. We call it Tombstone <laughs> or Dead Man's Fall. Uh, but we Take have trained trained facilitators that can can do team building for your company and there's always the, the cowboy part of it we have a, a a challenge in our team building where you get to put your own saddle together put it on a horse and get your team members through an obstacle course so we have what folks would normally think of as a team building event those that may have participated in one before but when you come to Westgate River Ranch it's going to be quite a different experience than you've had anywhere else with team building in terms of, uh, you know, I know in terms of a weekend away with, with the family, I mean, you do have not only the, you know, the lodging and now the adventure park, the ropes course. Um, there's a lot of more traditional outdoor activities you guys have at, at River Ranch that really, really shine. What, what are some of those activities? Well, our, our guests can enjoy, of course, horseback riding. Uh, we have a petting farm is absolutely complimentary to all of our guests. That's a great place for the little kids. You have the pony rides there. We're located right on the Kissimmee River, so we have airboat excursions available. Uh, our property is 1,700 acres of pristine Florida wilderness. It's mm -hmm. not a totally developed property, so the swamp buggy rides takes you out on the back of our property. Um, we have a nine-hole golf course with a driving range. Uh, we have trap and skeet shooting. Mm -hmm. Uh, and something that's really big with the kids right now due to the new movies that are out, we have an archery range. Uh, mentioned putt-putt golf earlier. We have fishing, swimming. You can bring your own boat. You can rent a pontoon boat. We have boating excursions being right there on the river. Uh, hay rides, cookouts. <laughs> if, if it's outdoors and you can do it, we've got it in some form. Well, you also have the longest running championship rodeo. Say every in the Saturday country. night. Tell us about that and then the street party or the street, uh, yeah, street party after. Right. Well, every Saturday night, 7 30, 52 weeks out of the year, rain or shine. Uh, it's one of the longest consecutive running rodeos in the state of Florida. We have bull riding, team roping, trick riding, barrel racing. The guest favorites always. We have a calf scramble for the kids where they get to come into the arena and chase the calf. And then right after the rodeo, you go right out in front of our uh, 1800 Authentic Era Saloon. Inside, there's a live band for mom and dad to go in. And we have a brand new area there in front of the saloon, uh, right off the Adventure Park where we have a DJ for a street party for the kids. That's every Saturday night. Mom and dad can be in the saloon. The kids can be outside with the DJ. And of course, the Adventure Park, you can ride the bull, zip down the zip line. <laughs> Uh, Saturday nights is a, is a big time at the ranch, but we, we are there seven days a week. We're open seven days a week all year long. And, and one thing, I mean, Ray is uh, on horseback at the rodeo as Masters of Ceremony, and one thing that, that is definitely apparent, and, and I know you've been out to the rodeo, mm -hmm. I mean, it is an all-American theme. Mm -hmm. the, uh, the, you know, thanks that, uh, that Ray and the staff give to our service people, and, and they really uh, they really do a good job at recognizing all the veterans out there, and um, they do a great job at that rodeo. So if, you ha if people haven't been out there, you have to go out and see it. Yeah, need to come see us. It, uh, one thing I like to express to a lot of folks is that we want you to come and be a guest. We want you to come get some accommodation, spend a couple of days with it. That's the only way you're going to get the true experience. But for our folks right here in Polk County, you can come out and catch a performance of the rodeo or make a day trip. You don't necessarily have to be a, a, a guest of the ranch to enjoy the activities that we have to offer. 
it's available to anybody. And you guys are very interchangeable in what you guys can do. Uh, we, we talked when we first started this segment about Tough Mudder being at uh, Westgate River Ranch and uh, tying in the sports thing. But, uh, of course, the accommodation is very much a part of it. But uh, talk a little bit about Tough Mudder and, and how you guys are able to host events like that. Well, one thing that we were able to accommodate them with was, was just the, the size of our property. Tough Mudder, it, for the folks who are not familiar with, it's a 12-mile course with military-type obstacles and we give them plenty of room to play with and be creative. Of course, we're, we're right there in the wetlands of the Kissimmee River, so there was plenty of mud, plenty of places they could build their obstacles. Uh, we're real proud that we, we hosted that event this year. Uh, we're gonna be the host for them in Central Florida for the next two years. Mm -hmm. Tough Mudder will be returning to River Ranch. This year brought in, in a two-day event, nearly 11,000 people participated in the Tough Mudder race, and we were real excited to to be a part of it. It's, it's an experience that it's, you just have to be there to see it. It's amazing uh, to see the people that challenge themselves on these Tough Mudder courses. All right, Ray. Well, thanks for coming by. What else do we need to know before we go to break here about uh, Westgate and the renovations and when is everything going to be done? Everything is 90% is completed right now as far as the room renovations were done. The new stuff that we're adding, like I mentioned, the, the bunk houses, there's still a few of those little projects under construction, but for the most part, the renovations are done, and uh, if you want to get room rates and availability, uh, always check out WGRiverRanch.com or WestgateDestinations.com. But to get our website specifically is WGRiverRanch.com. All right, Ray, thank you so much, and we look forward Glad to, to uh, all, all the people coming in and experiencing all the new things that you have. Uh, maybe